I was just minding my business, having a cold one, beating the wife, and then all of a sudden, giant alien saucers. Greetings mech warriors, hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is TTB, welcome back to German Mechgeneering and today guys I've got a build for you that uh, someone on uh, Facebook actually uh, sent to me and uh, it turned out to be quite the fun build, I've slightly modified it to be uh, fitting better to my tastes but uh, let me just say this is the fastest cataphract in the world, I love it, let's turn this bad boy around shall we, uh, by the way, Metal Crusader on the back, that's how you know it's me. Four leaf clover on the left arm, very important, and the uh, corgi. Is it corgi? Corgi? I know it's always hard to say. It's it's a it's a weird looking dog with a freaking sunglasses on it. Okay, so uh, turn this thing around and boom, there you have it in all its glory. It's got two eyes. It's got a mouth that says charge, and it's got a championship belt uh, equipped as well. And I painted it red so it goes faster. Okay, let's talk about the loadout, shall we? Now, as a Cataphract 3L, uh, we have a couple of laser hard points. We have a couple of uh, actually just one ballistics hard point, but that's not the point here. The point, so to speak, is the engine, because this Cataphract allows us to bring in an uh, engine up to a 340 rating. That means we can put in an XL340 engine for a normal walking speed of about 85 kph, and with the ability to put in mask, we can actually boost this thing to almost 110 kph 70 tonner in a sphere now let's look about the uh, look at the other features in here we have one two three four five uh, medium pulse lasers we got the lb10 auto cannon we've got three uh, two and a half tons sorry of the lb10 ammo and we've got mask mark 4 of course and we do have an inner sphere targeting computer mark 4 as well if you don't take the targeting computer you could, for example, um, go ahead and add, uh, like, throw out the light ferrule and then uh, maybe add one or two more heat sinks to that. I lowered the armor on the legs a little bit, but that should be fine. Also on the arms, which is not a problem because if you look at the mech from the side, you're going to take shots mostly on the side torsos or center torsos. The arms, even though they're big down here, like up here where you're actually going to get shot, uh, not that much damage coming in. So it's fine to remove about six armor from each arm and a couple more from the legs. Now... What else is there to talk about in this mech here? We have to look at the skill tree, of course. And the skill tree is not finished, which is perfect, which means that we can go ahead and finish it together right now. Um, so let's first take a look at the survival tree. The survival tree, I would say, this is the must-have for basically any mech that you're playing. Left-hand side of the survival tree for maximum armor. Then we're going into mobility, of course, for a maximum speed tweak. I chose to go right-hand side for faster breaks and uh, faster starting or faster speeding up the mech. And I also have torso speed here for being able to brawl better and being able to twist better. But I just spent 21 skill points in here just to get maximum speed tweak 1 through 5. Then we have the auxiliary tree, double coup shot with coup shot cooldown. And now we have, what is that, 41 points to spend. Let's see, if we go double artillery strike... And uh, let's say we are a brawler, so we might actually want to see our targets come in. So we go seismic and maybe go radar derp. Um, not really needed, but we could do it. Now we're at 72, and now we have to fill all of this. Uh, we could get LBX spread, we could get ammo, but I think what we definitely also need is heat generation. So I will probably go for laser duration here. Go down here, laser duration, grab these two heat gen nodes. Go down here, grab these two heat gen nodes. And now we have to, a choice to make. We could either just go like maybe maybe like get magazine capacity here, get a couple more shells, and uh, maybe LBX spread here. Grab that heat gen node, that and uh, another magazine capacity node. Every would be full. That would be fine. Or the other option is a little bit different, where we basically don't grab that. Uh, we go ahead and we don't grab the census tree, or let's say we just don't grab the extra radar deprivation nodes. And so we just have, what is it, zero radar deprivation, just seismic. And at that point, we can go ahead, go over towards this side, use high explosive to get here faster, grab two heat gen nodes, and grab another two heat gen nodes, and now we have two more nodes. Boom, boom. There we go. Almost all the heat gen nodes grabbed. Um, we could even potentially remove the... No, we actually, we want to have the range node, um, come to think of it. But we could remove these two, grab another laser duration node, and uh, as you can see, like it's, it's it's basically mix and match. I might actually grab another range node in here. It doesn't it doesn't really matter. The point is, if you go gonna go seismic, you have to fiddle around a little bit with the firepower tree. But this would actually, I would think, also work. And you got everything except 
two heat gen nodes left and right here and we even got one point in magazine capacity so we have enough firepower now i've been talking for too long now so um let's have a look at the mech once again it's all its glory it is beautiful i've got three matches lined up for you guys the first match is going to be um seeing this thing just run through targets and murder them the second match and the third match are both going to be uh, three matches today because i like you guys the second and the third match are very very interesting because on the on the second match you will see what happens if your team doesn't push with this mech and just hangs back and then directly after that perfect example same map same spawn points what happens if you get a couple of people that actually listen to you instead of just pepegaing and just join you they don't even have to be amazing they just need to be there so you have more tonnage more more uh, bodies in the fight so that's i think it's very interesting to see so i hope you'll enjoy that and by the way guys very important if you want to if you want to send me builds if you want to ask questions do that in the live stream i live stream six out of seven days in the week so i highly recommend you hop on over to twitch.tv slash the real ttb drop me a follow there and join in on the live stream that is the best place to ask me questions to provide comments and to, uh, to send me mech builds and anything else so I hope I'll see you there. And now let's roll the clips. Have fun. It's insanely delicious. Oh, um, I think I've maneuvered myself into a spot where I don't even want to be. Luckily, we do have the speed, so we'll just Artillery strike online. correct that mistake. Target's sushi. Fine. Oh, hey, I've, I've had some of the freshest sushi Artillery I've ever had in Vancouver. That was delicious. Indian food is English style. Yeah, um, funny thing is, um, I have a master's degree in English. Never been to England. And I'm from Germany, so it's like it would not be that big of a stretch. And I definitely plan to visit England at some point, um, starting the tour like in the south, like Exeter and whatnot, White Cliffs of Dover, making my way up to London, and then further north. Into the Scottish lowlands and highlands. And then finishing on Isla, laddie. Target spotted. Artillery strike. Speak Target Russian, never been there. <laughs> you never been there's Italian food at the Chinese buffet? Yeah, it's like, hey, let's have some let's have some let's have Target some Chinese spotted. buffet. Here is here is your um your chicken nuggets. <laughs> It's the food for the kids, right? Um, or, uh, I don't know. <laughs> Here's your pizza. <laughs> spotted. Oh, dear. Oh, lordy. Oh. Artillery strike activated. You looked at me longingly. I didn't like that. Ouch. That was a lot of damage to me already. We're doing some potato pepego. Uh, rotato potato pepega is here right now. So, Target. don't like that. Oh, I do like that, though. Target spotted. So Black Jackie trying to run. Little does he know that Destroyed. something's coming on. Okay, no, something's not coming on the flank because it's already dead. Acquired. All right, maybe you can go catch the health spawn if you. Ch oh. New target acquired. Target destroyed. Rip. This just doesn't have much firepower here. I couldn't even kick the side draws in one shot. But maybe I should have just shot the lasers first. Might have been better. Did you even try to turn Target around? Spotted. Maybe he knew it was over. Target acquired. Gave in to his fate. That's a king crab again. Dude. Target destroyed. The United had his ass Target in the way. Spotted. Couldn't shoot the king crab. Target Ow! Target and there's the reward for my stuff here. I get shot in the face with an artillery strike or airstrike, whatever. There's two dudes over here, so there can't be that many around here. Let's get in on this. Rip. Destroyed. Rip. I, I know that his side torso was open before because I targeted him. Acquired. Rip. What are you doing, good sir, huh? You're dying. That's what you're doing. Hi, how's it going? Don't need that arm, do you? Ouch, that hurt. 
Oh oh. Yeah, yeah, but hot. <laughs> well, five kills, GG. My work is done. Also, XL, not a problem. My CT is red, everything else is fine. <laughs> five kills and 300 damage done. Yep. Yep. That is what you call German efficiency. Alpha Strike is about 200 damage, five kills. <laughs> we did 300, what? <laughs> Pretty good. Pretty good. You don't get match score for that. Match score is based on damage, unfortunately. And other stuff. Not on actually efficiently killing the enemies. Oh well. GG. Isn't, isn't that the way that things go normally with alien spaceships online. that they appear from out of nowhere? Sensors online. I was just minding my business. Online. Have a cold one. All Beating the wife. And then all of a sudden, giant alien saucers. From out of nowhere. So I got pretty angry at them. Because I had to, you know, stop drinking my beer, stop beating my wife. It was really, really cutting into my daily routine. I don't know. Would a, would a, would a wife beating beer drinking rednecks say routine? Probably not. I can't do it. Target spotted. Also, um, target coming right up. Target spotted. Where are all these guys coming from? More importantly, where are my teammates? This is this is Pepega. This is classic Pepega what these guys are doing right now. Standing on the outskirts not doing anything. Uh oh. Go for this. You're dead. Ouch. My teammates still haven't moved. Rip. Okay, two assaults down. Unfortunately, there's more. Wait, but wait, there's more. Yikes! Run! Hey, yeah, yeah, this is close. Way closer than it should be. Target acquired. No, oh dear. Yeah, we're getting rushed by three mechs now. Ah, oh, unfortunate. So this is this is an example, guys, of why. I would get pretty angry at my team because these potatoes have done nothing except sit around on the outskirts all match. And that's why they're losing right now. This guy is just AFK, which doesn't help. Lerm Nova Cat, no reason to be sitting here. Should have been with me. That stalker is dead. Still rain. 
Let's go there. Two months in a row. Thank you so much, buddy. Enjoy the emotes. The spirit of... You had a team? Yeah, no, I didn't. Like, you can, you can easily see that when your teammates... Um, when your teammates take that much time to move towards the center or don't, not even move into the center at all, uh, you, you know you're dealing with um, the, have already the cream of the crop. Be sure to stop them. Uh, we took down two assaults solo, so I'll take it. Still. We are halfway to defeat. What are these guys doing? I just told them where he's AFK. And they're shooting like whatever buildings over there. <laughs> They've taken down beta. <laughs> to all surface troops. Enemy forces are moments for victory. Center torso critical damage. That's it, pack it up. The hostiles are taking control of the target. Well, we got two solo kills, 700 damage done, uh, 474 damage taken, four components destroyed. And um, yeah, the Nova Cat on the outside was actually doing some good damage. Quick Dry V4 was doing some good damage, but it doesn't matter. Like if you can't if you can't get the other guys into the fight, um, especially like awesome 160. Yeah, yeah, no, just 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 no. Um, I had three teammates, and the enemy team had. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven teammates. So they had twice the amount of people that actually did a little bit of damage. That's how she goes sometimes, but it's okay. You should, and also you should not try to help teammates in this game. You shouldn't. That, does, that has nothing to do with not being a nice guy or whatnot. The problem is that most likely you are going to maneuver yourself into a situation where um, it's even worse and you die as well. Even 1980! Hey! Thank you for the sub! Appreciate it! Enjoy the emotes! May I suggest that the real tilt emote? Make liberal use of that. It's very disturbing. Should I try this? I'll try it. He doesn't believe in torso twisting. <laughs> See, that's how easy you can kill an enemy assault. You just have to have speed. You just have to put the pressure on. Oh, hi there. Oh, fuck, he's got a friend. He's got a friend. Oh, oh. Uh oh, not good. Bye bye. Beautiful. These guys are moving with me. Well done, guys. Keep the push on. Very nice. What do we have here? Nah, not him. Not him. Not him. I look towards Delta 4 guys. Support a direwolf. That is what I'm looking for. New target acquired. Let's not overchase this dude, because the enemy team is gonna be over here. New target acquired. Hunchback to C. Okay, I think this is not a bad spot. Target target acquired. Artillery strike online. Artillery Drop the out of here. Hopefully it's concealed. A little bit, at least. Um, uh, maybe. Target spotted. Target spotted. Critical damage. Ouch. Heat level critical. Let's move around. Maybe engage this gentleman here. A little bit of damage to him. Keep supporting the whale. There's one guy through the middle here. Is that the hunchback? Okay. Yeah. 
take on this guy before he kills my teammates. There we go. Turn around. Very nice. Die away is leading. Good, 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 good. Let's go on Bravo. I should not have done this. But okay. Ouch, 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 ouch. Rip. Oof. Okay. Four targets left. There's a cougar coming in. Target destroyed. Down. Uh, Gruner's gonna run around a lot. New target assassin. Applied. Yeah, I'm gonna help with the assassin. That's a dangerous target. target Damn it. Heat level critical. You're shooting me. Is it the assassin? Maybe. He's lagged. Bye bye. I said bye bye. There we go. Unfortunately, I did not kill. Whoa! Oh no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. He's fresh. And rip. The reason why I did not engage this is because I was one shot. So. No need to gift myself over, right? Especially not against uh, an assassin that's fresh at this point in time. That was very well played by the team. One killing blow, 10 assists, 2 KMDDs, 640 damage, 441 damage taken, 3 components destroyed. Nice. Also, top damage in the match. GG's. Now, compared to the other game that we just had, you can see like the clear difference of what happens if you actually have a couple of people that push with you. Like, if I have a couple of people that push with me all of a sudden, um, what would be a sure death for me is just a starting an avalanche. Like, the little snowball that gets running gets bigger and bigger until the enemy team just gets squashed. That's how you play this game, guys. Going in and being aggressive, not sitting around on a hill somewhere. Unless, of course, you finish a match with 1500 damage and 5 kills, then, yeah, go sit on a hill. <laughs> uh. Even saying, mach weiter so. I will.